Good afternoon children. Today we will start a new chapter data handling. Now what do you mean by data? Data means the information you have to collect from your surroundings. Handling means how you can gather the information. A, 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 a collective information will be given to you and from there you have to segregate or find out the different types of information according to the question. Now suppose I am giving you a diagram. Please see the board you can understand. See there are a few mountains, a sun, two birds, a house and two trees. A picture I have drawn, a scenery I have drawn and I have given you here the information. Now from here I can frame many questions. So let us see one then you can understand how to collect the data from the given information. So this is the information given to you. From here we are going to collect the information of different types of shapes. How many shapes are used and in how many numbers. So see first one we are using triangle. Now you see how many triangles are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. So how many triangles are used here dear? So in this picture you have seen the mountains looks like triangle, the trees top is looking like triangle, the birds wings are looking like triangles. So from here we have gathered the information that there are 9 triangles in the picture. So we will write here 9. Now next one let us draw circle. Now, how many circles are used in this picture? See, 1, here 2 and here 3. So, in the given picture, 3 circles are used. Now, let us go to the square. So, all the plane shapes are drawn in the picture to frame a scenery. So now squares, how many squares are used here? 1 and 2. So 2 square and this is the big square 3 and here the small square 4. So 4 squares are drawn here and the left, left, last one that is rectangle. Rectangle. Now, how many rectangles are here? See, we can see here 1 and 2, 3, 4. See, in the picture we can see 4 rectangles are there. So, we will write here 4. Now, from the given picture, we have got some information. So that is the data. What data we have got? That the plane shapes are used here. Different four types of plane shapes are used. Square, circle, rectangle and triangle among them. And which figure is the maximum? Which figure is drawn the maximum? See here 9 is the maximum drawn so triangles are drawn maximum so if the first question is asked from the picture from the given picture which figure is drawn the most so triangles are drawn the most how many times it is drawn it is drawn nine times which figure is the least here which figure is drawn here least see from the given here we have got circle is drawn the least it is drawn three times in the picture. 
Next one, square. Square is also four times. Rectangle is also four times. So, if I am asking which figure, which two figures are having the same numbers of figures in the given picture. So, the answer will be square and rectangle. Square and rectangle have the equal numbers of figures and that is 4. Now, if in the question if it is asked, how many houses are there? So, you can tell there is one house. So many questions are, can be framed from the given picture. So, that is the data and to collect them it is known as data handling. How you are handling, how you are gathering and how you are collecting the information from the given picture or from the given data. So, there is one house. Now, if I am asking how many mountains are there? So, we can see here there are three mountains. How many birds are there? See, there are two birds. How many trees are there? So, there are two trees. So, this is the information which we have collected from the given picture. So, again I am repeating. See, in this picture we have used the simple shapes. Now, simple shapes means the plane shape that is square, circle, rectangle and triangle. Now, data handling can be done through anything. That means maybe names of some fruits, pictures of some fruits, vegetables, flowers can be given to you and from there the collection whatever you are given colors. So, from there the information will be asked to you to inform you whatever question will be asked to the point answer. No need to write in sentences, no need to write in full sentences. The data handling questions will be in long form but the answer will be objective. The answers will be always in the objective form. That means you will be asked question how many mountains are there? The answer will be only 3. How many trees are there? So answer will be only three, uh, 2. But the questions will be in the long form. Now the question, uh, the pictures that one example I have given here, the examples I will show you any many more examples but the question may be framed from the alphabets, from animals, birds, colors, fruits, vegetables and many more information from your classroom. So the books, copies, whatever it may be but the from the given information you have to find out the answer and you have to reply the given question. That is all related about the data handling. Nothing else. It is a very easy topic and I hope you all can answer it well. So, let me revise it again. So, how many birds are there? There are two birds. Now, birds are drawn with the circle and triangle. So, each bird is having two triangular shaped wings and one circle. So, if I am asking how many circles are there, so you can say there are three circles. And how many triangles are there, see one, two, three, already I have put number to make you understand. But in exam you no need to write the numbers, you will directly answer. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and nine. So nine, triangle and triangle. Suppose I am asking. In the word triangle, how many times A came? So you will tell only one time because the spelling T R I A N G L E, A word, the A alphabet is used only one time. So you, the answer will be one. Okay? Thank you, children.